KYE News of the Ozark CW starts with breaking news. And that breaking news is in South Central Springfield. Two people are dead after an overnight shooting. That's right. Police were called there just before 1230 to East Erie. You can see that neighborhood just west of Jefferson Avenue, north of Walnut Lawn. Reagan Natrolio has been there all morning. Reagan, what's the latest? Well, Chad and Jackie, this is still very much an, an active investigation. And take a look at exactly what we're seeing out here. You can see there's officers, there's a crime scene investigation unit, and there's also police officers over here tagging the area. It looks like they have narrowed down the crime scene. Now, here's what I know so far. When police arrived over here to this neighborhood, they didn't find the victims or the suspects. Now, that's because witnesses took the two men to the hospital where they died from their injuries. Now, police did catch up with the suspects running to get into a car that was near the Rapid Roberts at Campbell and Walnut Lawn. That's just west of where I'm at right now. Now, that's where they were then arrested. Now, I talked with SPD officers, but I also chatted with neighbors here in the area who say that they were very startled and shocked when they heard shots ring out. I was laying in bed, I was like half asleep and I heard five shots go off and I was so scared. Um, I called my mom and I was just kind of freaked out because I didn't know what to do or where it was coming from or what was happening, but I knew it was way too close. <laughs> Now, police are still out here investigating, as you can see. We're going to make sure to keep you updated on air and online with everything that we find out. We'll, we also expect to learn the victims' names later this morning. But for now, live in Springfield, I'm Reagan DeTrolio, KY3 News.